Hey guys, Ritzy here. Um, today I'm doing a kind of overdue video, but hopefully it'll be good. Um, I have with me here December and January snack crate. Um, I've had December's crate for a while. I was going to film it last month. But, um, things came up, my depression has come back, so it's a lot harder for me to film videos and stuff. Um, and with January's crate, um, it was actually, uh, like, held uh, overseas because of all the conflict going on overseas, um, so I got it like two weeks ago, no, like last week actually. Yeah, I got this last week in the mail, so it's late. So I figured why not open both of these together, starting with December's crate here. I can't remember if I said this in the last video, but, um, I have purchased these Snack Crate subscription with my own money. I'm not sponsored by them, uh, but I will give you my full opinion on these snacks, whether I hate them or like them or not. Um, and this is a series on my channel that I hope you guys all enjoy. So let's get into it. This is the box. Uh, this month's theme is Egypt, which is kind of cool. Um, the, uh, DreamWorks, I think it's DreamWorks, the film, uh, The Prince of Egypt is one of my favorite, like, animated movies about Egypt. Um, I love watching all kinds of, like, uh, his history shows about it and everything. Um, so, Egypt, cool. Nice. Um, huh. that's fun. It's got like gold confetti and a girl dressed as like a, a ruler and the guy in black. It's pretty cool. Um, this seems a bit thicker than Greece from uh, before, but we'll see. And, um, I also kind of changed up my, um, what I wanted out of my snack crate, because, um, I had it put to sweet and savory, or I, th I think sweet, but I did, I, I picked, uh, surprise me for the, for the newer ones, so, let's see what we got here, uh, looks like we have some pretzels. Time flavor baked pretzels. Abu Auf. If 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 I'm saying that correctly. And they're baked, not fried pretzels. That sounds really good, honestly. Ooh. Oh, those smell really good. Mmm. That one. Oh, they're so tiny. They're so small. Ooh. Oh. Those are really good. Oh, I didn't grab any water. I'll be right back. I'm gonna get some water. I feel so bad about that. Should have had water before I started this, but I didn't, so here we are. There we go. That's better. Having water. Okay, so these pretzels are really good. They're time thyme flavored. Um let me laugh this straight. That's annoying. Um yeah, they smell so good. 
This one really good. I need another one. Mmm. Well. I kind of taste like if you would crumble up, crumble them up and put them on pizza, they'd be really good because time. Oh, wow. That is so good. I'm definitely gonna have my partner try one of these. They're very good. Like, this is a good use of time. I know that time can be like a very overwhelming spice if you use it incorrectly, but if this is used correctly. So good. The next one is uh, some chips. Uh, kettle cooked potatoes. Um, the brand is raw. They're gluten free. Uh, cooked in sunflower oil and their sweet chili flavor. Oh, that's nice. I don't really much care for chili flavor stuff, but we're gonna try this. Try this and see. Uh, they don't smell too good to me. Oh, I ripped the bag. Oh well. Maybe my partner will eat these later when he gets home. Uh. Oh, no. Yeah, no. I do not like those. Nope. If it were any other flavor, I would be happy, but... Oh. oh, silly me. I forgot to read the book for these. Uh, <laughs> no! Shoot. Oh, well. Um, let's see here. What do we have? Oh, huh. So, the kettle chips. Sweet chili kettle chips. An irresistible fusion of uh, crispy... Perfection and a mouth-watering sweet chili flavor. The zesty heat of chili complemented by a subtle sweetness creates a bold uh, and utterly ad addictive Egyptian flavor. No. Not for me. Made for someone else, but not for me. I don't like those. Nope. Okay, then let's see. Where is the other thing? Oh, here it is. Um, the Abu Afu Af Alf 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 pretzels. Um, crunchy, shiny brown pretzels sprinkled with a flavor of sea salt, flavorful sea salt, and dusted with earthy herbal notes of thyme. One handful. Everybody knows the rules. Okay. Hmm. They, they, these are really good. Um, these are probably my favorite things in the box so far. You know, only like two things, but oh joy! Something I won't eat. Nuts! Yay! I don't like nuts. Um, <laughs> anyone who knows me knows that I can't stand the texture of nuts. Um, I love peanut butter, but I don't like nuts. So. I'm not probably I'm not gonna like those boxes much, but these are peanuts, um, chili and lemon flavor peanuts. Ugh. That doesn't be chili stuff. I have to try some. Maybe my partner will eat these. Uh, if I can open. There we go. I inhaled that. Uh, I do not like that smell. No, chili, ch chili and lemon and peanuts do not go together. I'm going to suffer. It's so big. Look at that. It's huge. Mm, I don't want to eat this. No, oh, I can smell it. I mean, the the peanut part of the smell smells good, but the chili and lemon, like, 
Eh, no. Okay, I'm putting these in a place where my partner can see them when he gets home. Ugh. I don't want to eat this. Oh well. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh. mm. no, ah, uh. all oh, did not is good at all. Yeah, oh, no, no, well, that did not taste good at all. Oh boy. I'm not going to lick my fingers because I don't want to taste that. Oh. I do not like that. Oh, guys. I might have to turn my crate back to, like, chocolate stuff. Ugh. I don't like that. Um, okay. Go Nuts Peanuts. A uh, symphony of tangy citrus and fiery chili spice dashed and dazzled on crunchy Egyptian peanuts. No. I don't like peanuts. Hmm. No. Next thing is this Sneepo Caramel Bar. Lovely. Nougat and caramel with peanut coated chocolate. I don't like this box at all. I don't like peanuts. Um, Sneepo Caramel Bar or Caramel Bar, depending on how you say it. Indulgent fusion of tastes that combine is that. Wow, I, 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 I can't, I can't words today. Let's try that again. An indulgent fusion of tastes that embodies the essence of Egyptian sweet creativity by combining the luscious creaminess of caramel and peanut butter chocolate with the delightful chewiness of nougat. Okay. This might might not be too bad, but since it has the peanut pieces in it, probably won't like it. I don't know. I don't want to let this smell everything. Just a thing, I guess. Smells good. Smells really good. That's what, what it looks like. Looks pretty good. I mean, uh, It's not bad, but it's not good either. Like, I don't know. Maybe it's the nougat. I'm not really a big fan of nougat kind of stuff, but it looks interesting with the nougat. Oh, I don't know. I'll probably end up powering through eating this one, maybe while meditating or something, and eating the, the pretzels too, so, yeah. Okay, next we have this Cocoa Lover's Crispy Bar. Um, Cocoa Biscuits, Fruit, and Nuts. Oh. It's another thing I don't like, with nuts in it. And fruit. Not a big fan of, like, dried fruit stuff. Not at all. Um, rich cocoa infused chocolate studded with dried fruit and crunchy nuts. Yay. Oh, well, we're gonna try everything in these boxes because why not? I get to suffer. Yay. Okay, that ripped nicely. Um, trash. Uh -huh. Oh, this is pretty big. 
Again, I just smell everything. Ooh. Honestly, it doesn't smell too bad, but... Hmm. 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 <clears throat> okay. Hmm. That... Honestly... It tastes pretty good. Hmm. Wow. Hmm. I'm trying to place what kind of fruit is in here. Hmm. Interesting. I don't hate it, but I don't like it either. Um. Well, the writing's so small in here. Jeez. Oh, it's from Kellogg! That's cool! Hmm. Wow. Um. Honestly, the, this isn't too bad. This isn't too bad. I mean, it's it's a real different kind of flavor, but it's good. Put it in the good pile. <clears throat> and then, <clears throat> last but not least, we have this Marlowe's bar. Uh, cocoa nougat coated with chocolate. Um, this kind of sounds like a Three Musketeers. But I know that like through musketeers is not nougat, but it's like something something else. Um, but I think just the um <laughs> the wrapper being gray kind of just reminds me of through through musketeers, <laughs> which is one one of one of my favorite candy bars. If anyone cares to know, my favorite candy bar. Uh, Marlowe's bar. This confectionery masterpiece combines the, ver the velvety goodness of nougat with the richness of chocolate. A delightful melody of flavors and textures. Awesome. This is something that I like. Oh, there's a fly in here. Turn it. Oh, he flies. I hate bugs in here. We had a mayfly in here last night. Scared the crap out of me as I was here on my computer. It like flitted across my screen when I was watching something and it scared me and I'm like I don't like them at all. Nope, not a nope. Oh, it's got a cool texture on the bottom of it. Look at this. It's kinda cool. Huh, neat. Wonder if that's from like the like chocolate press or something from the bottom of it? Neat. Oh my goodness. <clears throat> the, this definitely gets stuck in your mouth and on your teeth, just like a three musketeers bar. Wow. Very uncomfortable to have it on the roof of my mouth. Oh boy. I'll get it off later, but th this, th this, and the pretzels are my favorite out of the box. Okay, and um, as I said before in my last video, I get the mini size box because it's what I can afford. But if you get the original, you get more stuff. If you get the premium, you get more stuff. They have in here, and um, if I had gotten a drink this month to upgrade my plan, I would have gotten the Oasis Peach Apple 
drink, which would have been cool because I like peaches. But it is what it is. Um, I like how they have everything in um, this pamphlet. They have the mini stuff at the front. And then if you get the original box, it's a few items more. And then if you get the premium box, it's everything in the, everything in this pamphlet. Plus the drink. I'm pretty sure you get the drink if you upgrade to a like premium or something. But yeah. So this is the Egypt box for the month. Good stuff. Good stuff. My favorite thing was the pretzels. Pretzels are really good. Okay, so I will see you guys in... Here we go. No, wait, wait, no, 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 I have, I have another box to open. What am I doing? I'm silly. I have another box to open. Wow. I'm smart. I even said I was going to do two boxes. Wow. So let's put this stuff back in here for now. I'll eat it later. And we have this box. I forgot what I was gonna do. So this is a January box. Let me just open it here. My Nice with my blazer. Eh, go. Eh. Okay, so this is uh, January's box when I opened the door with December. So, January's country is Turkey! Awesome! Turkey! That's neat. Turkey. Ooh, wow. Oh boy. Okay, so this is turkey. Cool. I like turkey. Kind of. I, 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 I like their like whole aesthetic as a country or as as a as a as a place. Yeah, we like their whole aesthetic. How they dress. Colors and stuff. Okay, um, let's see here. First thing, um, Cheetos from Turkey. Um, oh, lovely. They're peanut flavored. Ah, yeah, I'm definitely taking the thing for peanut stuff off of my thing. I, I don't like it at all. Lovely. Never thought I'd see peanut flavor Cheetos. Like, why is this a thing? We're going to try this. Mm. Mm. Oh, gosh. I don't like peanut. Why is it such a thin bag? What the heck? That's weird. Cheetos bags here are a lot thicker than this, huh? Hmm. Oh, it smells weird. Hmm. Oh, what the heck? They're smaller. Huh. Doesn't really look like a Cheeto. Huh, interesting. Hmm. Uh, a, che a Cheeto should not smell like peanuts. Mm -mm. That tastes so wrong. Like, 
Hmm. I don't know. I don't like it, but I need another. If I can grab it. Yeah, no. That doesn't taste right at all. Nope. No. Ugh. Okay, let's check the pamphlet. See what it says. Cat? Oh, wait. Check the pamphlet to see what it says. My cat. Uh, Cheetos peanut peanut puffs. Um, if you're a Cheetos lover, you'll enjoy this nutty take on the classic cheesy Cheetos puff. No, no, this ain't it, Chief. No, this is not. No, I did not enjoy this. I want regular Cheetos now. <laughs> ah. That's probably gonna go to my partner because he 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 likes nuts. Okay, next is to Doritos. That's cool, Doritos. Um. Okay, Doritos taco flavor. Oh, spicy taco. Okay. Okay. Um, Doritos spicy taco. The chip everyone loves with a spicy taco flavoring. It's like you're eating a crunchy spicy taco, but it's Doritos. Hmm. That sounds kind of up my alley because I am, like, um, Mexican on my dad's side. And I, 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 I like tacos. So, I'll probably like these. Let's open it. There we go. Oh, that smells really good. Wow. They they really don't give you a lot of chips. Jeez. It's like two-thirds air. So, they usually do it. That's how they get you. Um, oh, well. Try this. Oh, that smells good. Ooh, yeah, it smells really good. Hmm. 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 That's also not too bad. Um, I feel like I can make some dip. And then dip these in the dip. <clears throat> and it's a bit better, but it's not as, like, in your face as I'd expect Doritos to be. Huh. It's kind of subtle. Hmm. Yeah, it's kind of really subtle. Huh. I like that. Awesome. Okay, next we have this. Um, Etty Hawk Cake. Um, I don't know what this is. Let's check the book. Uh, Pop Cake. A sweet and moist fun-sized cake. Filled with smooth banana cream, delivering pure banana bliss in every bite. Ooh, that's cool. So it's cake. That's neat. I like cake. And I like banana. Yum. Oh, that smells very banana. Ooh. Oh, wow. That smells so good. Mm. 
Huh. It kind of looks like a giant eclair, but with chocolate on the top and the bottom. That's so cute. I love this already. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, wow. Mmm. Oh, yeah. That is my favorite thing in the box. That was really a... Like, if I ever wanted turkey, I could see myself buying that. Because it's really good. Okay. Next thing. Uh, a... Dido, Dido, Dido Bar, Dido Bar, who say, I don't know how to say this, it's D-I-D-O, Dido, Dido, I don't know, Dido like the band, I don't know, oh, I can't just lock something off somewhere, okay, this, um, Dido Chocolate Bar, Dido, Dido, like the band Dido, I don't know. Um, let's see here. Uh, you get the best of all the worlds with this yummy wafer treat. Featuring milk, white, and dark chocolate, it's a cocoa extravaganza. Ooh. Hmm. Huh. But this just looks like a regular chocolate one. Huh. The one they have is like a triple... A trio one with all three flavors. Mm, this one just looks like chocolate. Okay. Uh, I'm, I'm perfectly fine with that. <laughs> I'm not the biggest fan of white or dark chocolate, honestly. But, yeah. Oh, wow. It's just a big bar. I thought it would be in pieces. But, no, it's just a big bar. Yeah, cool. Okay. Hmm. 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 So, this kind of seems like Turkey's version of, of a Kit Kat. Because it's got layers on it. And it's just milk chocolate with, uh, like, a uh, wafer. Ah, yeah. It's good. I mean, it's kind of regular since... We have Kit Kats here, and that's one of my favorite candies, like, ever. Like, Kit Kat and uh, Hershey's are my favorite chocolate candies ever. Like, yeah. This is pretty good, though. And it's a full bar. Like, it's, like, that that big. Mm. More big. <laughs> Hmm. Next thing, this Al Benny bar. Hmm. Sorry, so chocolate in my mouth. It's making me salivate. <laughs> yeah. Um. Um. Al Benny Bar, a delicious treat combining a chewy caramel layer with crispy rice coated in a silky milk chocolate shell. Okay, so, cool. Okay, this looks like a simple bar. Cool. I don't know what this reminds me of, but it reminds me of some kind of candy we have here that kind of looks like this. I don't remember the name for the life of me. I can't remember. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Alright. Hmm. <coughs> wow. It's so, 
It's too soft. It's not very crunchy at all. Wow. I really like this. Like, this and the pop cake are my favorite things in here. Like, oh, wow. That's good. I'm going to be in a sugar high later. I'm going to be doing dishes and making pork, pork chops for dinner. And I'm going to be in a sugar high. <laughs> okay. Last thing in here is this cat, cat, cat. Oh, another nut thing. Joy. Yay. Okay. Cat, cat, tap bar. A croissant-like Turkish pastry filled with chocolate. Cat Cat Tat translates to layers of flavor, an appropriate name for a timeless turkey snack. Okay. That's cool. Hmm. Uh, <clears throat> Puff Pastry with hazelnut, hazelnut cocoa cream. Okay, so it's hazelnut. That's okay. Hazelnut is stuff I like. Okay, open them. Oh, wow. Um, oh, there's like crystallized sugar in it. Ooh, interesting. I don't really much care for these kinds of pastries, but it certainly looks nice. It looks really pretty. Uh... Let's try it, I guess. Eh. Do it, do that here. Crumbs. It's flaky, so they're gonna be crumbs. Wow, a lot of crumbs. Jeez. Wow. Okay. Mmm. 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 Yeah. I got just pastry in that bite, but you can see the um the hazelnut in there. Wow. It's really, really buttery. But not expecting that. Wow. That's pretty good. Let's take another bite. And th th this is very flaky, so I'm holding it over the box so I don't drop anything on the floor because my cats will eat it. I don't want them to, so be good to your pets. Eat over your box if you have to. Mm. 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 I don't like that. It's not something I would eat like all the time. I guess, like, the flakiness kind of gets me. That That's not really my thing. But it was cool. It was fun. Hmm. So, yeah, my favorites out of this box are the Owl, Owl Benny Bar and the Pop Keck kind of banana cream cake thing. So good. But yeah. Um, thank you for joining me for these uh, unboxings. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, there will be another one for February whenever the box comes at the end of the month. I'll probably make it in March. Just because um, I don't want to do things too quickly. Uh, so yeah. Thank you for watching. Bye.